If you work in community services, you understand that from time to time we all face barriers. Whether it's barriers to getting a job, accessing adequate housing, getting professional help, or just doing the everyday stuff. Over the next five years, the health and social assistance industry will be the fastest growing industry in the state, adding around 70,000 new jobs to the Victorian economy. At the same time, youth unemployment in Victoria sits at around 11.4%, a figure which is above the national average. In the west sits Bendigo, where youth unemployment sits at 18%, one of the highest in the country. Thousands of young people are reliant on a system which struggles to find them work. And for many, this long-term struggle can lead to feelings of helplessness, apathy, and result in depression and anxiety and long-term disengagement. In response to this, Jobs Victoria has launched the Community Traineeship Pilot Program to support young people who want to begin their career and Victoria's many thousands of organisations who are undergoing growth and want to create employment opportunities for young people. The program will run for 12 months and aims to match 200 young people with community organisations throughout Melbourne who want to give a young person an opportunity. Organisations are matched with a trainee and given incentives to help with wages and supervising the young people while they develop their skills and expertise, and they also get support from a team of youth coaches and trainers to ensure the traineeship is a success. Meet Ellie. Ellie comes from Broadmeadows in Melbourne's north and has recently left home, which has been unstable for the last couple of years. She hasn't had a job before, but she was the top of her class in high school. She's interested in helping people, but really wants to explore before she commits. Her youth worker shared the community traineeship program with her and she was immediately interested. Through the program, her youth worker helped to get in touch with a large charity organization who have a disability care arm. After being interviewed for a position, Ellie started with the organization, working there four days per week while studying a certificate four in community services at RMIT one day per week. Whilst at work, Ellie got shown how to provide support services for people with disabilities and quickly learned to work unsupervised. At the beginning of the program, Ellie didn't have much money and she was unsure if she could pay for books for study or even transport to and from her new job. However, her youth coach was able to help using the flexible wraparound support fund included in the program so Ellie could focus on studying and mastering her job. The 12 months passed quickly and Ellie had learned a whole range of new skills. Her employer loved her and as the traineeship had now finished, she was offered a fully salaried position in the organization. Now Ellie has been able to rent her own place and she set herself the goal to stick with the organization and become a manager in the next few years. She's really thrilled and so grateful to her youth worker and her employer for giving us such an amazing opportunity. Because of the community traineeship program, hundreds of other young people just like Ellie will have the opportunity to kickstart their career. So I'd like to get involved. How does it work? Ready to help a young person and add a valuable new staff member to your team? Contact us on the details below for a confidential discussion today. Positions are limited, so act quickly to ensure you don't miss out on this great opportunity.